Hey, welcome to this radio video and another video where we talk about QSL cards, actually four QSL cards from my collection uh, while I'm slowly digitizing uh, on YouTube my collection and uh, also it's a cool way to uh, make share with others my QSL collection and uh, so here are four cards all from Radio Japan uh, one of my favorite stations for QSLing uh, because they had such nice cards and back in the 80s they would send out a lot of stuff you know in their envelopes envelopes would be big and full of uh, all sorts of goodies and uh, so um, Radio Japan was nice it was hard to hear Radio Japan in the 80s they did not use any North American relays so what happened is that in the 80s you'd hear Radio Japan direct from Japan except for a few exceptions of uh, uh, using the uh, Moyabi uh, Gabon transmitter site on some transmissions in French and English but most of the transmissions were direct so here's uh, Radio Japan Tokyo with a nice card for uh, September 9th 1984 on 17825 a frequency I believe they're still using um, now a lot of these stations had these really you know frequencies that were they would use for years and years and never left uh, an example of that now is uh, Radio Australia um, for as long as I can remember when I was young the first time I heard Radio Australia morning was 9580 that is a main frequency they used all the time another one they're still using and I use a lot in the evening was 21740 that's also a frequency that never changes 17825 is the one for Radio Japan so we look here Radio Japan thank you Mr. Little No so I try to put it here visible and uh, February 22nd 1984 on 15300 ah, there's a little error probably on mine or I remember that it was 17825 and they made an error I don't know but it's 15300 here it says so we see that there's a little error on my sticker um, so this is for Radio Japan and they always had extremely beautiful cards Radio Japan is the king of beautiful cards uh, there are a few stations like that that have cards that are incredible uh, Radio Japan is one Radio Australia was one also they always had really nice cards uh, Radio RSA which is now Channel Africa also had beautiful cards uh, Radio Japan with uh, Mount Fuji on uh, via Sackville Canada so this is one with Sackville relay on 14 July 1992 a little later in the uh, 90s 0100 UT 5960 they had really really good signals oh this is the error probably uh, this one probably it goes on the other sticker so this one is not even Sackville Canada <laughs> it's, um, don't look at the stickers look at the back of the card I think that's the best way uh, October 16 1983 uh, so this is one I believe you know now that I think about it I, I believe this is my first or one of the first QSL cards I've ever received from uh, Radio Japan that's on 17825 that was direct from Japan back then this one was what the other one was February 84 so I, I think this is the first card I've received from Radio Japan Mount Fuji really nice card let's turn it over and continue with very beautiful cards of Radio Japan and so let's look at the cards in the uh, in what's written instead of the sticker I think it's gonna be better from now on a uh, very beautiful card of some festival with dragons in uh, Japan uh, for a report that if we look is for September 9th September 9th 1984 and uh, on 17825 kilohertz so you see even here the stickers are no good on this one um, I think I've probably screwed up something here so um, 17825 was one of those frequencies that uh, in September at the uh, you know near the uh, equinox we'd uh, hear them 
uh, quite uh, often on that frequency uh, direct from Japan and here is another Radio Japan very beautiful card once again um, for a report if we look here that is from Sackville Canada so this one is from Sackville uh, probably I screwed up mixed up the cards of the different stickers actually so this one is from Sackville Canada relay July 14th 1992 I believe that's what it said on the other sticker so I probably put the stickers and screwed up the cards so it does say here from uh, Sackville transmitter size 5960 250 kilowatt power so uh, one of those nice cards once again from Radio Japan so uh, I'll have to fix that hope you enjoy these videos of QSL cards and maybe they'll give you uh, you know that little flame needed to uh, write stations let them know you're listening and maybe do a little QSLing yourself so uh, thanks for watching 73